Hello all. So in this lecture we will see bubble sort. So bubble sort is a simple sorting technique. So in this example we have to sort these elements in the ascending order. So we will start from the first element. So what we will do is we will check whether the first element is greater than second element. So we see that 9 is greater than 6. Then we have to swap these two things. Then again, we'll start from this element. We'll check whether it is greater than the next element. So we find that 4 is less than. So we swap again. Then we'll check whether 9 is greater than 10. It is not. So we'll start from this element. 10 is greater than 8. So we will do the swapping. Then we'll check whether 10 is greater than 2. It is greater. So I will do swapping. Then we'll next check for these two elements. 10 is greater than so 10 will be positioned at 6. So after the first pass, the, that is the end of the first pass. So, so after the first pass, the largest element will be in the last position. Then again, we will start from here. We will check whether 6 is greater than 4. So 6 is greater. So we swap here. Then we check whether 6 is greater than 9. No. Then we will start from here. 9 is greater than 8. So we will swap here. Then 9 is greater than 2. Again, we have to swap. Then 9 is greater than 5. Again, we have to swap. So after the end of the second pass, the second largest element will be positioned in the correct position. Then again, we will start from here. 4 is not greater than 6. Then here, 6 is not greater than 8. Here, 8 is greater than 2. So we will swap here. Then we will check whether 8 is greater than 5. So again, swapping will be done. So at the end of third pass, the third largest element will be positioned here. Then again, we will start from here. 4 is not greater than 6. Then 6 is greater than 2. So we will swap here. Then 6 is greater than 5. So we will swap here. Okay. So it will end here. Then the la fourth largest element will be positioned here. Then we will again start from here. 4 is greater than 2. So we will swap here. 4 is not greater than 5. 5 is not greater than 6. So we will stop here. We can stop. It will go there. We will stop there. Then again we will start from here. 2 is not greater than 4. So nothing will happen. 4 is not greater than 5. Like this it will go on until the elements are sorted. So we will see that the elements are sorted in this man. So this is bubble sort. So bubble sort uh, will start sorting from this side. So the largest element will be sorted. If it is in ascending order, the largest element will be sorted first. Like this, it will go like this. So that is why it is known as bubble sorting.